suddenly a beautiful girl with a blonde hair uh, sends you a friend request and you're like oh hi sweetheart how are you you too also take out your clothes and then you become naked boom they record your video we're gonna share with every of your friends transfer me thousand ringgit transfer me two thousand ringgit so people don't usually report this the sad part is the girl is actually not a girl if you receive a request from a sexy girl imagine that's me Wanakam, welcome and salam sajatra. This is Msan's words, thoughts and emotion. So what is the word for today? The word for today is uh, cyber sex. Okay, don't worry, I'm not gonna get naked in this video. What we're gonna talk about is a kind of like a scam, kind of like an attack that uh, hackers and scammers do to get the money out of you. And most of the victims are male and they are also female victims. So that's what we're going to discuss today. So stay tuned to this video. We will talk about how people get cheated with this uh, cyber sex scam or cyber sex extortion. Let's begin. Now think of this. You are browsing through your social media. You know, you're going through your Instagram. You're going through your Facebook. And then suddenly a beautiful girl with a blonde hair. Okay, beauty does not mean blonde hair, but let's imagine, you know, a beautiful blonde hair with uh, some nice figures uh, sends you a friend request. And you're like, oh, somebody wants to be my friend. So you go ahead and accept the friend request. And immediately you get a message from them saying, hi, sweetheart, how are you? And you're like, okay, I want to chat with this girl. So you go ahead and actually chat with this girl and then you know you have some conversation and then they say they ask you hey uh, do you want to see me naked what did he say they're yeah, like yeah i want to see definitely see a naked person so you say okay yeah i would like to see you uh, uh nakedly then they're going to give you a skype link or could be any kind of link where they're going to bring you to a video chat now once you're in the video chat and then you know they, they, they start to take out their clothes uh, you get excited you too also take out your clothes and then you become naked in front of a camera and then boom they record your video and then they send you a message hey look you know what uh, we're not gonna talk so much this is your video which you are naked you gotta pay us some money if not we're gonna post this in your facebook in youtube we're gonna share with every of your friends now you get panicked and what do you do you're gonna pay them the money and then they keep coming for you they're gonna ask you back they're gonna ask you back to transfer me thousand ringgit transfer me two thousand ringgit and a lot of people in malaysia are victims of a cyber sex scam or cyber sex extortion because yeah this kind of like involves uh, shame so people don't usually report this and then they kind of like go through this process so this is the sad part what is the sad part? The sad part is the girl is actually not a girl. Imagine this, me being that girl. The, the, the technology has grown so far. I can insert a girl's video. I can give commands to the video. So act like taking out the clothes, do some, you know, uh, some sexy dance for you and everything it's just a video and you get cheated because of this now what if you become a victim of a cyber sex scam I hope you don't but let's say you become a victim of a cyber sex scam what you want to do is number one block all communication with the scammer second do not pay them money if you do pay them money what does that tell to the hacker or the scammer is that this actually works uh, they're gonna actually keep on doing this they're gonna try to do this on other people so don't ever make the payment uh, I know that you probably don't want to go ahead and make a police report but I strongly urge that you go ahead and make a police report and finally stay away from this kind of a friend request don't get naked in front of a camera uh, don't trust links that are sent by strangers and it, you should feel suspicious if suddenly somebody became your friend and all they want to do is offer sex video to you i don't think so a real person would do that and again i would like to remind you that if you receive a request from a sexy girl imagine that's me 
Thank you for watching this video. Please do share with your friends. Keep them safe, make them aware. This is Msan's words, thoughts and emotions. Thank you for watching.